the United Nations Geneva. Father Michael Christopher Deep at a side event with Paolo Pinero and Archbishop Mirkis of Kirkuk, Iraq. It is part of Father Mike's assignment as permanent delegate of the Dominicans for Justice and Peace to the UN. By our being in the UN, we want him to continue to challenge the, the ways in which people are thinking about things which are often in a very narrow concept of their own national interests, their own local interests, their own tribal interests, etc. And to be wanting to broaden all of that, to, to see that the whole human race, every person in the world and every part of creation in fact is created by God and is therefore has fundamental human dignity, rights for to be preserved and to be uh, nourished. Father Mike Deep was born in South Africa. He made his first profession in the Dominican Order in 1987 and was ordained to the priesthood in 1991. Since 2014, Father Mike is the Order's delegate to the UN. He tells us about his experience of how the United Nations perceive religious organizations. Generally there's quite an, a big openness towards who we are and what we are. And, and even, uh, I think there's a recognition that, you know, as church we've played a significant role in the, in the development even of the UN. Often our presence uh, people are, are looking for because they know that we won't, we're not trying to defend our religion or our particular national or local interests at all. And therefore we would have more credibility in fact. We have certainly contributed to many discussions that have eventually borne fruit and we could point to things like the death penalty, uh, issues for example of indigenous people who have been marginalized and who have not been responded to in, 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 in South America. We've also been trying to um, engage with the issue, for example, the, of what's going on in Iraq. This is a blight on the whole international community. Many people, including Pope Francis, have stressed the importance of the international The Dominican Order has a long history of involvement in issues of social justice and human rights. In the 16th century, Dominican philosopher and theologian Fray Francisco de Vitoria developed a new approach about international law. And we could even say one of the founders, therefore, of the, the UN concept. And we even, he's recognized by, in New York, in the grounds of the UN in New York, there's a statue of him there. And in Geneva, one of the main halls of the council chambers in, in the Geneva UN office is called the Francisco de Vitoria Hall. Sent out to preach by Dominic, sent two by two to all the world, sent out to study the gospel of grace, to find new ways to preach. It seems that both forums in which Father Mike engages have this in common. The members are required to take actions in order to change the world.